Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. And once again, I am working in the Rip It, Write It drop book. And the prompt that I'm working on is place coins under the page, make a cool pattern, then shade using a pencil. Well, I didn't eat make a cool pattern, but I used change that I had in my pocket at the time or on my desk. And then I also collect um, smoosh pennies, and I used some of those. I thought that would be cool to use for the rubbing. So I'm placing it all over the page, not making a pattern. And now I'm getting a pencil. I think I got a crayon. Yeah, I got a crayon. And did the rubbing that way. You can't really make out some of the things, the um, smush pennies, but you can see some of the stuff. And there's the page, and you'll see a couple up close pictures. And now on to the next front. Which is pretty basic. Get a, let's take a bar of soap and rub and scratch all over the page. And that's what I did. I found a little bar of soap that I got, you know, when we stay at a hotel. Because I use, um, you know, liquid soap. <laughs> So I'm rubbing all over the page. This was a pretty quick one. And here is a couple, or one close-up picture of that. And then now we're going on to the last prompt for the video, which is have an afternoon tea on this page. Spill a bit and take the wrapper from your tea bag here. Describe what the tea the right one of you liked it. Well, I just put tea on the page. I made tea. I don't usually drink it, but this was a free sample, and I went and got some hot water, let it steep a little bit, and just took the tea bag and or a paintbrush and brushed it on. I did heat set it a bit so you can, I can add more. And I didn't write what it tasted like or anything because I didn't try it. I just did it for the tea dye. And I did let this page sit overnight because it was still too wet for me to add the um the bag. I'm using Ailey's um, clear gel tacky to glue that on. I thought it'd be cool to add it like a little pocket. And here are some pictures, and that's it for now, and thanks for watching.